I'm a geospatial engineer and I'm collaborating with a number of interdisciplinary discovery teams. On one of our projects, I'm connecting with civil engineers and working together to improve rescue response times during a natural disaster. Every day, scientists and engineers are receiving terabytes worth of data from high-resolution satellite images. Over time, the accumulation of this data begins to give us a very strong understanding of the normal geographic and structural landscape of a specific region. Now, consider a scenario where a city has just experienced a large earthquake that's produced extensive damage over a wide area. Taking satellite imagery from before the earthquake occurred and connecting the two images captured after the disaster, we can tell if a building is leaning 10 degrees more than it was a day ago, indicating it might be in danger of collapsing. And we can more easily identify the most damaged area or areas where citizens are cut off from help. The algorithm we've developed to process this imagery provides actionable information in a few days, rather than the three to six weeks it might take using traditional damage assessment methods. Using this data, we are able to more quickly and accurately position first responders to rescue those in need. The time saved can equal save lives. At Ohio State, we're using translational data analytics to ask the questions yet to be asked and tackle complex problems not yet solved. We call it Big Data for Good.